friends, um, have you been driving around and then a literal rock comes and smacks your windscreen? Yeah. Oh, what you're left with is something like this. Uh, if it'll focus, then you know, run your finger across it and you'll feel it. So the reason why I'm recording this is I didn't know you could do this. Apparently, you can fix it yourself. With this, it's sold in basically every single country. Some people haven't had that much success with it, but I think I know a few things to make it work a lot better. For the first steps, you want to have your car in the shade. Um, so... Into the side. Hey, 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 get the fuck off there, man! Ooh. A little bit of dramatic opening. Bruh. I shouldn't have done a dramatic opening. Ah, uh, shit. There's definitely, there was a razor blade in there. There was a razor blade in there, and now I have no idea where it is, so... Oh. The next person who sits in this car may get a razor blade up their fanny. Something? God, this thing is recording and it just completely screws up how synced the audio is. So if it is like not synced carefully, it's because of the f***ing mic or the f oh. Um. Oh, brother, this guy stinks! I threw you guys at the ground. I'm sorry. It's for the video. But first, you gotta get your razor blade that comes in the kit and you just gotta scrape over it to see if there's any extra glass in there. Maybe try to feel around in the actual chip. And I'll clean it. POV, you are a Jose. Hmm. <laughs> Not that good. I didn't mean to do that. Oh, brother! Yes, so and the next one is to get actually your applicator that this center it right over our chip. Press it down. Now what we've got to do is we've got to put it along here so if any of the resin runs down, it'll be caught by the masking tape and it won't go everywhere. Step two according to the old instruction manual get the other thing that came in your kit this right and we've got to screw it into this to be quite tight but not excessively tight and then you have to make sure that that is centered with the actual contact patch of the chip so if you come in from the inside you'll be able to see that from here we actually can't see Bruh. it Okay boys, I've actually got a much better idea. So obviously, just make sure you have this split like that. You'll close one eye and look through the hole as you put it on and keep a, an eye on the center of it to make sure you're covering the center. So we, uh, okay, use your words, Stylus. Reason, we're gonna drop three to six drops of this stuff in there. Now I've heard you should probably do more than you think, so I'm probably just gonna do five, you know? Okay, now we have gotta turn this in basically all the way is what it said. Dripping out. Don't just start like tapping around the outside of it. Apparently that gets it nice and good. 
gets it to spread all the way through the chip according to Chris Fix. So, yeah. Okay, next steps. About six minutes later, you come back and you see that all this resin has gone and down here. So the little tape hack is pretty useless. But for now, what we gotta do is unscrew the top part. No, not the whole thing, mate. Just, just the top. Just the top part. Just the top part. Wait, you guys, wait there. Let me do this. Oh, yeah, there's a vacuum. Oh, there we are. And then go straight back in, put it back in. And just do it just like before. Let's have a mid game break and discuss. What is happening? What do you think, Paddington? Yeah, can you guys shut up? The little 2cc moped, please. Sounds like a lawnmower, mate. Yeah, he agrees. So, uh, no one else has had these issues. It's probably because me and I'm an idiot. Uh, if you can't tell, uh, somehow I got a scholarship, but I'm dumb as hell, so. Do the step again when you take it all the way out. Oh, let's do this some, some tapping. Out. Back in and twist this whole thing out. Oh my god, that's looking good. I have done, I've had literally the worst experience possible doing this. Everything that could go wrong has gone wrong, but it is looking so much better than anyone else's. Like, I, I'd call that god tier basically, you know? Next step is what we're gonna need is one of these little little things. Why has it got a whose hair is that? It's my hair. Is it? What's a bit long? So we've got to add a drop of this onto the top of the chip and we just gotta place this on. Now what we wanna do is have that part of the windscreen in direct sunlight. So you know, I don't think if the company realizes it's a first step, you're meant to have no sunlight. Then 10 minutes later, you're meant to have lots of sunlight. H how does, how do they think the world works? But, whatever. So now I want to move the old Hondux again. K24, cold start for the boys. And the girls, the four girls who ever watch this. Oh, the power. The fury, the passion of the almighty K24 Hondux CRV, mate. Mum's not watching, those are expensive glasses and they, they, they just fall and hit, hit the flipping floor, mate. <gasps> oh, this car. stopped recording. Why? Why did you stop recording? I can't reach. Now. Okay, so the next part. So a lot of people when taking it off they'll just get that and rip it off. According to Chris Fix what you should do is just put your finger over the chip and just slightly peel it off all the way around. And then when you get to the chip bit, just twist it. Now, you'll see, you won't be able to see on camera, but there is still resin there. Quite a bit of it, because I put too much on. So you got to get your razor blade at a 90 degree angle and just scrape it. Oh no, I, guys, I'll scratch my windscreen. Nope. This doesn't scratch your windscreen. It, it sounds bad, but it doesn't scratch. The packaging says there's no need to be easy on it. That seems rather scary, so I'm just gonna be slow and listen to this beautiful noise. So, that is done. Let's take a look. So, here's the before, obviously. Okay, now let's see the after. Um, if we can find where it was. Nope! It's kind of showing how much of a job it did. Is it that? Okay, it's that. I think it's this. Can you see the, the um, phone won't even focus on it? Whoa. Well, this plane shut up. Bruh. 
Where the hell is he? Oh. Ruining my shot, lad. See, like, I can run my finger over it. I don't even feel it at all. It's worked so good. So, yes. Do I recommend the Rainex window chip slash crack slash Bruh. bullseye slash star repair kit? Yes, I do. 30 something bucks and it's completely gone. It is epic. That's perfect. What do you think, Paddington? I agree, mate. Now, that was the video, so please consider liking and subscribing. We'll see you next time.